Hello, this is Panasonic's latest computer, the Panasonic SV. Let's note. Uh, this computer replaces the previous model, which was an SX, and it's a little bit smaller, a little bit lighter, and has a few different features. Um, the optical drive pops out of the front here, and this can be a Blu ray um, or a DVD drive, and some models have an option for no drive at all. Uh, looking around the computer, we have a standard Panasonic 12, uh, 16 volt DC in. Um, there's an air vent for cooling. This comes out um, a little bit warm when the CPU gets a little bit of um, hits. The HDMI is up to 4K60. It's got a USB 3.0 on this side, a USB-C 3.1 on this side, uh, wireless on off switch. Over here is the power switch, um, a SD card slot, headphone jack, and this has got the built uh, mic and headphone in one single jack, um, LED indicator lights, um, DVD drive, uh, or Blu-ray optical drive, whatever. The USB um, 3.0s, you've got another two on this side, um, an analog um, RGB connector there. A, a gigabit LAN, um, a security fix point, um, stereo speakers up here. Um, up the top of the screen, you've got a microphone, um, dual microphones. You've got a um, a camera, HD camera, and also an infrared camera for doing face unlock, um, something like an an iPhone or something like that would do. Um, looking at the back of the computer, there's nothing on the back, and underneath the computer, um, there's no um, external uh, ports for for dock or anything like that underneath. So the spec on the computer, uh, this particular model has 16 gig of RAM. They come with 8 or 16 gig. Um, it's got a Core i7 in this model. Um, you can get a Core i5 model as well. Um, this one's got the Core i7-8650U, runs up to 4.2 gigahertz. Um, SSD options, you've got a 1 terabyte in this model. Um, they do come in 256 or 512 gigabyte. Uh, optical drives, DVD option, or uh, this one's got a Blu-ray in there. Um, they do have an option for an LTE model, uh, an LTE module, and that uses a nano SIM. The screen uh, six is a 12.1 inch, um, and the battery, we've got a standard battery in there, it'll run for uh, on the battery test up to 12 and a half hours with the standard battery. Um, using the larger battery, it will run up to 19 and a half hours. They are battery tests um, to compare models across different uh, computers, so you'd expect about 70% of those battery test uh, times in real world usage. I'll just show you a um, how fast it can shut down. It's quite snappy due to that SSD in there, and it's it's a um, quite quick to shut down, and it's shutting down, still going. You can see the lights just cut out. So start up test. Um, I'll show you how quickly it starts up. Mini, uh, mind you, this one's got no um, nothing other than the standard programs installed, so. It doesn't have anything else starting up at the same time. It's just a stock Panasonic install at the moment. And that computer just started up pretty quickly. Okay, we'll just power it back on and show you how quickly it can start up from zero. Power switch, bottom left of the computer down here. And then um, due to that snappy little SSD in there, it's going to boot up pretty quickly and it's ready to go. So there it is, Panasonic's new computer, the SV. Uh, you can order them now. They're available from the website, links in the description. Thanks for watching.